We don't normally dwell on competition, but there is another television station in this area that we think you might be interested in. It is called KFJH, Channel 5. I don't know whether you've heard of it or not. It is just getting started in the auditorium at Friendswood Junior High School. Here's Dan O'Rourke. And now, stay tuned for Friendswood Update with Penny Henry, Elizabeth Nelson, and Christy Connors with sports. Okay, y'all ready to go? Roll VTR1. Okay, five, four, three, two, one, roll reel. And Q1. Today's menu is fish filet, french fries, lima beans, raisins. They are seventh graders at Friendswood Junior High, 12 or 13 years old by anyone's definition, newcomers to the television news business. But now they're going out live to monitors in other parts of the school. There is real pressure to get it right the first time. Today's weather partly cloudy with a chance of rain Friday becoming fair Saturday. High Friday, mid 60s Jack Colliban, who's actually a science teacher, started offering his TV production class last year. Now there are about 35 students who switch jobs with each newscast on the Mustang cable system. Today, these three ladies happen to be in the spotlight. They got to rehearse the program three times before their live appearance, a rare luxury in the business. But in other ways, they have adapted rapidly to the role of TV news person. Like most anchor people, they have mastered the friendly, audience-building smile. Like most anchors, they keep half an eye on taped reports and commercials and correct their copy at the same time. Like most anchors, they shuffle their scripts when they can't think of anything else to do. Consider footwear optional. Nobody will ever know. And like every anchor person, they make mistakes. This is That's it for sports, Penny. Or forget things. Question of the day. The next question of the day, what did you think of the Yo-Yo Magician? Roll VTR1. Why did you change? Hello, I'm John Chancellor. Here at but NBC. the station is building with promotion. While in your own community, you can rely on the people who keep... Some of the kids say they'll pursue careers in television. And while they learn from their experience and their mistakes, no one's paying them a big salary. They just get graded when the news is over. Dan O'Rourke, Channel 2 News.